We're going to be trying out different uh, cocktail recipes in these little boxes that you can take on the plane. I'm going to do it in a as true to life situation. As if I am on an airplane. We'll see how it goes. Wish me luck. We've got our very sleek looking cocktail kit. Comes in a snazzy box. Champagne cocktail, oh that's cute, it says wheels up inside. I'm really into this. I feel very special, which is like not how I feel when I'm on a plane. So I've got a little spoon. I can't keep this, can I? Uh, oh, a little um, napkin, oh very classy. We have a little instruction manual here. Uh, what's disappointing is that the vodka is not included. So I am to procure a mini bottle of gin. Press the flight attendant button. Can I ding for hot water? Bing, bing, bing. <laughs> thank you so much. Ah, beautiful, thank you. All right. I'm sure all the passengers are quite impressed by my little thing here. I don't know where they expect me to do this. Okay, using the jigger, measure one half ounce of tonic syrup into a cup of ice. Oh, I forgot to get the lemon wedge. All right. Oh, and I need club soda. <laughs> I didn't forgot about the club soda. It doesn't smell that great, and I'm hoping it's not like super sweet, because I like mine. Uh, the little bite. Add the mini bottle of vodka. Squeeze in the lime wedge. <laughs> or dump it in, I don't know. And the club soda. Half the bottle that's right. The lemon packet. All right, so full mini bottle of whiskey, that seems right. We're gonna put a whiskey, I guess just one of these sugars in here, and the bitters. I'm supposed to take this guy and dissolve this. Not really helping to dissolve. I've got a half ounce elderflower syrup, so I am going to stick it into the cocktail. Oh, and it looks like I need a lemon. Do you have a ding? This one's quite big, so I probably won't squeeze it the whole way. Pour in champagne. Nice fizz. It's gonna have seeds in it. This is a lot of work for the salt, but maybe it'll be worth it, we'll see. Then add half bottle of Bloody Mary mix. Um, add mini bottle of vodka and tomato juice and squeeze the lemon wedge into the cup. I like it really lemony, so. And then there's a little spoon, this is so cute. Stir for 10 seconds. Moment of truth. It's all right. Not the worst hot toddy I've had. It doesn't quite taste like an old fashioned. If there's, there's vodka in there, but uh, the ginger syrup is kind of subtle, which is a little disappointing. It's pretty good, actually. It kind of tastes almost barbecue-y. The tonic syrup is a little weird. I feel like I added a little bit of cough syrup. I wouldn't call my mother up and say, hey, I just had the best Moscow meal ever in my life, because it's not. I would think regular tonic water would be definitely better than this stuff. The only thing that I would be worried about is a lemon wedge. I'm not sure how often you can get that on an airplane. I mean, it's simple to make if this is what you want to do. It's kind of fun. I don't know. Plane rides are, can be boring. This is a good, like, two minutes of entertainment. I might feel awkward assembling a cocktail while in the middle seat of an airplane just because my arms tend to do whatever they want. I mean, I, I don't know, what, what do these cost? Oh, it costs $30. Oh. I don't know. Uh, $30 for each of this? That's a lot. <laughs> You're kidding. And you don't even get the gin? Four ounces of not great bourbon is not super expensive. And for $30, I would expect that in the packet. The price point is slightly ridiculous. I'm leaving it. I would take it, yeah. I would gift it because it's a cute gift, but if I were buying it for myself, no way. I'm leaving it. I would take it, I like it. I will leave this right here. It will not go with me anywhere. 